what's up everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so before we start i would like to greet everyone happy new year um this will be our first video for this year for 2022 um and we're going to play pokemon yellow again so in our last episode we've got our seventh badge um now for today i will show you um a way on how to um duplicate um the items that you have on your bag um before we start um for those who has not yet subscribed to my channel please hit the subscribe button and please um click the bell icon for the notification of my upcoming videos so before we start let's do our intro first Alright, so let's start. There you go, seven badges. And <laughs> our playtime is at 20 hours and 6 minutes. Let's get this done now. So, what we need to do first is um, you guys. Um, these are the requirements that uh, we need to have. First is, you need to have a Pokemon that has a special stat. For me, I've got this um, Mew. Um, look at the special stat. Um, it's at 184. So, it's either 183 or 184 stat. So the question there is, how are you going to have um, a Pokemon that has a special um, special stat of 183 or 184? So um, what you need to do is uh, obviously in when your Pokemon levels up, all of these stats: attack, defense, speed, special, all of them level ups as well so you can just level up your pokemon grind um do some battles with random pokemons or you can also use an item called calcium um that boosts or that adds special stats stats to your pokemon as well um for me what i did here is um i I got a save somewhere else or, or from Google I grabbed a save a save file from Google and transferred this Mew into my save using Pokehex. If if you all know how to use Pokehex, um you can transfer a a a, a Pokemon from from a different save file to your save file um i'll try one of these days on how to um use poco hex so that's the first requirement you need to have a pokemon with a special stat of 183 or 184 next one is you need to have the item that you would like to um to duplicate or to clone um for me what i'm going to uh to do or, or to use is this um master ball so right now i only have one master ball and what you need to do is you need to have the item that you want to duplicate on the sixth slot so in order for you to transfer this all you need to do is look up for the item that you would like to duplicate and press select and then put them on the sixth slot one two three four five six and then press select again 
And there you go. It's transferred now to the sixth slot. And then afterwards, what you need to do is first of all, um, yeah, sorry, I I forgot. You need to have a Pokemon that has a fly. Um, like this one. Yeah. Uh, my Pidgeotto has um uh, a fly. Uh, HMO, what's this? H HMO two. If I'm not mistaken. So you need to have fly or one of your Pokemon. You also need to have a escape rope. I'll I'll show you later why you need to have this escape rope. So once you have uh, those. Uh, requirements all you need to do is go to where are we now go to cerulean city all right you need to go to cerulean city and then this on this bridge um if you remember i uploaded on how to catch me this is the same thing that you would need to do so here once you're in cerulean city go to this bridge and then there's a train there down there um um your goal is for them to to notice you but before uh, they could notice you you should use fly right away so you need to have quick hands here on how to do this i'll show you how to do it so you, you you'll go down here where's that go down here and then press start um quickly there you go. So I went down on the direction where uh, this NPC will will notice me. This guy will notice me, and then what you need to do is uh, press start um, straight away before he notices you, and then what you need to do is collect. Um, one of your Pokemon that can do fly. Uh, where's that? The uh, Pidgeotto fly. And then what you need to do is look for any trainer that you haven't fought yet or you, you haven't defeated yet. So for me, I'll go to this Selden City. There you go. You notice me, but I immediately do away you will notice that you will not be able to use your start button that's fine that's normal so you need, what you need to do after you uh you flew away from that guy look for a trainer that you haven't defeated yet Alright, so I'm in the, um, I believe this is the cycling road, um, this guy on right, I haven't fought that one yet, so, just go to, um, the direction where he can notice you, and then, battle out that trainer. So you need to defeat uh, that trainer that uh, you need to that you will battle. You need to defeat them. Under shock. All right. So one down. One more. Alright. 
Alright. Well, there you go. Um, we have defeated this trainer. Um, next step is... We need to fly to Cinnabar Island. So, here in Pokemon Yellow, um, uh, Game Freak removed the, uh, the glitch wherein you will swim here, here, on the side of Cinnabar Island, and you will encounter a missing note. So, it's only, um, you will only encounter Missing No here in red and blue, but for yellow, there's no Missing No here. So, what we need to do is, oh, sorry, uh, what's this, this is the, the mansion, I, I believe this is the Cinnabar Island mansion. We need to go to this uh, building and then just just follow the just follow this uh, steps or this the path that I will take on this video so you, you don't need to battle those what we would need to look um for this is a Dito. We need to battle a Dito here. So here, on this part, if you followed where I went in this mansion, you need to go to this part because this is where you will encounter a a Dito. You just need to patiently search or wait till a Dito appears. Oh, that's a Grimer. Need to run away from that. Hope this Sadito. No, eradicate. We can just run away from that. A Dito. No, <laughs> it's a Grimer again. There are times wherein you will be lucky, wherein your first encounter will be a Dito, but there are also times, or most of the times, is you'll need to really search for that Dito. Like this one, it's eradicated again. Need to run from that. Where are you, do Where are you, Dito? No, that's eradicate. Let's run. This one, no, the Grimer again. Let's run again. Not showing up. <laughs> uh, what? There you go. 
Oh, this is a veto. <laughs> it's another Grimer. Alright. That's fine. You just need to be patient. That big rat again. <laughs> A mouse versus a rat. I hope this is Sadiro. No! <laughs> Why do you keep on showing up? Not you. Again, all right. Give me a Dito. There you go. That's a Dito that we want or that we need. So that's a level 24. So once you've encountered a Dito, you need to switch your Pokemon. Which has a stat of 184, a special stat of 184. Need to switch it. Then Dito, the enemy of Dito, Dito will copy or transform. Just need to defeat that uh, Dito. Oh! No. Did I use this one? Let's <laughs> be psychic. Not sure if using transform will... Will ruin the glitch. Let's see. Uh, Alright. So, remember earlier you, uh, I, I told you that you need to have escape rope this is what you need to uh this is the use for the escape rope because you should not after defeating that dito you should not encounter any pokemon oh in order for you to go out you need to have escape rope all right so next step is we need to go to Cerulean City again. And once you're back to Cerulean City, you need to go to the bridge again. And then this will show up there. That's a sign that um, this, the, the glitch is still there. But the problem here is, do we have a missing note? We will find out. Let's see if we have a missing note. I'll press B for this one. There you go. I hope this is a missing note. There you go. It's a missing note. So once a missing note appears, it's... I could not say it's a hundred percent. It's a 90, uh, a 90, uh, uh, let's say 80%, 80 to 90% that the glitch will work. Um, Alright, so all we need to do is defeat this missing no. That missing no is harmless. Alright, so once missing no is defeated, let's see if this glitch will work let's check the our item on the sixth slot ah uh, there you go so it worked um once you've seen this weird triangle icon and then um a nine at the end of it it only means that the glitch worked 
So I believe this is not sure, correct me if I'm wrong, it's at around 128 to 150 Master Balls. The reason why um, um, it's showing this triangle icon and the number 9 is because I believe the, the program for this one could not um, type in a 3 digit number. So that's the reason why it has like a, a glitch symbol on it. Alright, so there you go. We have successfully duplicated um, the master ball. So any item here, you can put it on the six slot and do the same steps again. Alright, so hope that everyone... Um, was able to, to get this um, walkthrough on how to duplicate um, an item using this glitch. Alright, so before we end this um, video, um, for those who that who has not yet subscribed um, to uh, my channel, please hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon for the notification of my upcoming video so before we end this one again always remember study hard work hard but play harder ciao everyone peace out thank you so much